for Virtual Console okay. involved Urban Champion. You're right. Okay, I just didn't want that to. Final Fight is like mistake that. one notch of badness left. Well, it's sad because nobody expects Urban Champion to be good. Right. And you do expect something. Okay, from we're Final talking Fight. about we're talking about the Super NES version of Final Fight here. Which right. Is, yeah. Super NES version of Final Fight is, is so missing the good character. Got rid of the hookers. <laughs> it's yeah. Well, there's I no mean, whiskey in the got game. Got rid of Sodom. Come on. I mean, oh right. No, they, they changed his name. Okay. They changed Damned to like Dickhead or something. And Sodom is. They got rid of the beard. Yeah, what is Sodom? Sodom, Sodom is uh, Katana. Katana. Yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Right. <laughs> okay, so let's let's enumerate the flaws of Super NES Final Fight. Okay. First and foremost, no, no whiskey, player, no Sodom. Third player. Right. Okay. Okay. Granted. Issue two. I'll give you that. No guy. Why the hell would you yeah. want to play Final Fight without Guy? Well, that's issue three. So you could release it later Mike. as a new cartridge. Right. But, but the thing about Final that. Fight Guy is that Final Fight Guy like has a, no Hagger. Yeah, so it's like playing through Cody, Blockbuster or something. The lamest too, character in either game. Like other places in life, sometimes you got to choose between your Hagger and your Cody. You can't have them both. And you can't you have any had Cody in, in either case. <laughs> Only yeah, in the you're arcade. You're stuck with Cody. Right. And then they had to bring him into Street Fighter Alpha 3 as like, uh, I, just, look, I gotta fight through prison because I'm grumpy. Any <laughs> game where the bad guy is a guy who is a in a wheelchair a with, in a wheelchair with a, with a who's crossbow faking it. who's faking it <laughs> is, is, is good in my book I mean come on that's okay. it that's gets thrown out of the window version. it's awesome okay but this is the Super NES version we're talking about yeah. and it is not worth $8 because you can go out to any store and buy Capcom Classics Collection Volume 1 right. which has the arcade version of Final Fight with multiplayer with all characters with and a bunch prostitutes of other <laughs> with whiskey <laughs> prostitutes galore yeah there's no there's no, no chicks everywhere no chicks with under boob when you hit them so right. Not right. worth eight bucks. I'm gonna get my own version of Final Fight with whiskey and hookers. <laughs> Fact, forget the whiskey. <laughs> I'm stealing your joke, Fact Shark. That's not my joke. I know, but you stole it earlier. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. So it goes around. So basically, don't buy Final Fight on Virtual Console because it's the really crappy Super NES version. It's like the worst console version. The Sega CD version of Final Fight was better <laughs> than the Super NES version. Well, yeah, but so well, why is that so surprising? Come on. Because Sega, Sega the Super NES was a more powerful powerful machine <coughs> than the Genesis. Well, yeah, but come on. Sega CD had the scaling and rotation. It was it was the GBA the Super NES GBA also. version. Yeah, but it was There's no scaling and rotation in Final Fight. It's not like you punch. <laughs> no, there is. It's not like you punch the logo. Dan the logo and the spins. logo, yeah. oh, whatever. <laughs> it's not like you punch <laughs> Damned and he spins into oblivion. That would be awesome. No, it'd be no, awesome. That, that you could like punch him and uppercut him, and he spins off in the sky. That would be some little flash. <laughs> It'd be great if Belger yeah. like scaled down after you knocked him out of the window <laughs> too. Like <laughs> fatality. Yeah. So anyway, yeah, that's the the biggest. But it's grievance. no urban shit. Like, okay, it's it's bad. It's not the best version of the game. It's still a pretty good game. Yeah, maybe not worth eight champions only five bucks as opposed to eight. Yeah, it's but the value dollar and the thing dollar. Is, well, there's that no and you know no fucking better well what you're getting with Urban Champion. Yeah, there's, there's no better version expects of Urban anything Champion. good of that. The worst you're gonna do is like, oh, that's terrible. Let's download that and make fun of it at a party. That's about the only time anybody would ever do that. Or like their kid like stepped on the remote or something. <laughs> But you're not going to buy virtual console version of Final Fight, oh, are you? Hell no, no. Okay, then don't defend <laughs> it. But I own it on Mega CD. I already own it. I own like the Final Fight Guy, Final Fight Two. I yeah, I own you paid it for Final too Fight many Guy? times. Yeah. Just you're because just it was problem. Just because it was the different no, version. Uh, mm -mm. Of course. How There's could you no, not? No. no how could it's you not? Excusable. And in other news of mediocrity this week, the uh, <laughs> virtual console is also host to <coughs> Mighty Bomb Jack, which. Uh, is a kind of crappy version of a mediocre Tecmo arcade game. Did you guys ever play it? I played it back in the day, back when it was brand new, and thought, this game really sucks. And guess what? 2007, 20 years later? Still sucks? Still sucks. It, it's one of those games that's just so bad it's become a running gag. It's not, it, no, it's not, like, hilariously bad. It's just kind of... I think it's hilariously bad. I mean... The, the funniest thing about it is that barely tapping the jump button will send you, send you like six miles 80, through the 80 sky. 80% of yeah. the screen, <laughs> if you press it all the way, or like hold it down, then you go 100% of the screen. Uh, yeah, okay. There's not really much point to what the What was game. the third game? Oh, it was third some shooter, wasn't it? It's Ordine. The Virtual Console already has a lot of shooters. And they're all like TG16 And shooters. most of them are really good. Yeah. Ordine is me really mediocre. It's one of those games that can't decide if it's a cute em up like Parodius or if it's a serious shooter. So it's got cutesy things and it's got serious things and it's really slow pa paced and pokey and not challenging. Kind of a fantasy zone kind of. No, well, fantasy zone is like fantasy all the way to cute, though. really. Yeah. <coughs> and this isn't really that fun. And it's at least a little well, unique. I mean, it's got Ordine. like that, that two-way defender kind of scrolling and shops and a bunch of other weird yeah. shit. Yeah, the best thing about Ordine is that when you go into the shops, like the English is epic. It's amazing. <laughs> I love I love the dialogue in the shops in that game. 
but it's not worth paying six bucks just so you can see someone mistranslate something. I mean, I got enough of that. I've got the internet right there. It's kind of my job to watch people mistranslate shit. Yeah, pretty much. So there's that little tiny bit of charm, but that's really about it. So it's like a, a week of bad arcade ports. Well, Centipede. There, yeah, last week was uh, Centipede and Millipede on Xbox Live Arcade. And with like with like a juiced up version yeah, on there. So it's like yeah. particles and shit splattering all over. Are a you, know what make it, you know what makes Centipede better? If you can't see what you're fucking doing. Let's do that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't think it was as bad as... Um, oh, no, it wasn't as bad as... Uh, what, Jetpack. What, Jetpack or what they did with uh, Every Extend. Or like anytime somebody takes a simple game, they have to stick like bloom and particles and just fuck off everything. Right. Well, you know, and we, that kind of works for, you know, Geometry Wars. Because that's, that's kind of well, the yeah, thing. Well, yeah, it's fine. That's, the that's, that's thing. like the point. But, but you, you it can still see centipede. what you're doing in right. Geometry Wars. And Centipede is just like this massive shit. It's sad, <laughs> and, and we scoff at it, and I and I think rightly so, because that's how we all feel about it. But I think there are those people that want to have the shitty 